to chase his own world record. Not sure he can get that fast here. But he just broke that world record a week ago. And the uh, scouting report or that these two European stops, Stockholm and Berlin, are the fastest pools on this World Cup circuit. That's another good point you make. These are really quick pools. A lot of people ask me, what makes a quick pool? Well, it's the depth of the pool, for one thing. The swimmer's waves bounce down to the bottom of the pool in a shallow pool, coming back up, creating turbulence. These are deep pools, great gutter systems, great lane lines that kill the waves. And then it's the ambiance. It's a nice packed house to see some really fast swimming. Seats just over 2,000 in Berlin, and now Kortishkin <laughs> looks like he has the race. <laughs> well, not he's getting pushed a little bit by Not Diedler. much, though. Not yeah. much. He's being pushed by his world record. That's who he's being pushed by. Look at this. And another one's going down. Wow. Kortishkin, he went 50-23 in the heats, and then he comes back in the final, goes 48-48, 51-100s. It's smashing his old record. Look at that. He keeps his head down, arms locked out in that streamlined position, one hand on top of the other, thumb wrapped around his bottom hand. That is a perfect streamline. The beautiful part about streamlining, that is the only way to streamline. So when you watch this, replay that. Get your DVR out, replay that. That is textbook streamline and another textbook world record.